In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Azure Sub to time shift your transcripts. Now, the scenario here is that you, let's say you have this great, this great video that you've done before, and you want to tack on an introduction to it. Um, and so you did this great video, and you had it transcribed, and you got this transcript from the previous video, and now you've tacked on a six-second intro to the video, and now you need to time shift the transcript before you burn your transcripts in. So what I have here is, and that's exactly what happened here, by the way. I have this video. I added this little introduction and a little piece of music that plays out. So you can hit a little piece of music. And what I have here is when I click on this, it's at 2 seconds, 22 um, milliseconds. It's supposed to be um, uh, let's start, and it's not. So this is not, uh, it's not correct. So I need to, to, I could literally go into the file and hand edit the whole thing, or um, Azure Sub has got this great little feature that allows me to time shift and it saves tons and tons of time. So this thing is supposed to be, let's start, and it says it starts at two seconds, but really it starts r right around, uh, let's start is right here, and we can play that. Let's set up, or let's set up. So it starts really at, let's for the sake of easy math, let's say it starts at eight seconds in. And, um, whoops, it's editing. So let's say it starts at eight seconds in. So I know it's gonna start at eight seconds in. And what I wanna do is I wanna time shift this whole thing. I want that to start at eight seconds, but I want the rest of it to be the same. Uh, so I want it to shift accordingly. So I've got two seconds, 22. And so what I need to do is I need to time shift the entire transcript by, let's see, seven seconds and my math's bad, 78. So I'm gonna go under here under timing and I'm gonna hit time shift. So I need to send this uh, seven seconds, um, 78 and if I add that together, 78 and 22 is zero, then that makes it eight plus two is 10. Whoops, sorry, eight. Boy, my math is horrible. Um, <laughs> um, eight minus 2.22 is 5.78. Whoa, wow, horrible math. Apparently I cannot do math. So this is a 578. So what I'm gonna do is here is I'm gonna do time and I'm gonna shift everything forward, all rows, starting and ending times by five seconds, 0.78. So now when I click on this and I hit play, it should go. Let's set up the Nexus 10. So the first thing I'm going to do. See, and now it's correct. The other thing that I need to account for is I need to create a new line that has my music in it. So right here, I'm going to right click and insert before. That gives me a blank line. And I'm going to go all the way from zero to this little music part. And I'm going to type in the words music bracket music bracket uh, whoops bracket and now what I've done is I've not only time shifted my entire transcript to be proper I have also added in the new um, line of the transcript to add the, the musical introduction so this is a phenomenal tool the little timing time shift is a phenomenal tool in Azure Sub